Hey everybody, welcome to the first week of Bearcat Outdoors. On this week's show, we're checking out a new crew member and figuring out where he came from and what his story is all about. Right now, on Bearcat Outdoors. My name's Kyle, I'm a freshman here at Northwest. This is my first year on Bearcat Outdoors with Cody. And my story really begins when I was eight or nine years old. My grandpa had always taken my dad out hunting. My dad passed it on to my older brother and I. And I was a few years younger than my brother, so I was, as they were going out hunting, it looked so fun to me all the time. But I was always, you know, too little, too skinny, or too weak, or whatever, to, to pull a bow back. And so it always looked so fun to me, so, so I would always ask to go hunting, and I would go and watch them and stuff. And eventually, I got my first bow when I was probably 10 or 11 years old. My dad bought me my first bow. And uh, it, was, it was just, it made it so much more fun, because I was actually able to go out there with my dad and with my brother and shoot targets and I actually, I once I grew up a little bit, started bow hunting a little more, uh, shot a couple does, shot some small bucks, shot one actually pretty nice buck and it just boosted my love for hunting, I mean, more than I could even imagine. And so I, I continued to grow up, meet more people, get into, get into middle school, get into high school and met more people that had the same passion as me and, and it was just really cool to, to kind of grow up a little bit and see that there was a lot more people out there that had the same desire that I did. So around the same time that I got my first bow is when I got my first camera and I just had a cheap plastic tripod with it and I would, I would go out and film just random stuff. Um, the first real memory I have of filming a hunt is I was turkey hunting in a ground blind and I was just filming anything I saw, a tree moving or a, a turkey walking or anything and I never knew how to edit anything and I just didn't really know what I was doing at all. But I, right then is when I'm like, when I realized that I love being able to film my stuff, film my hunts and bring it back home and show things and show everyone. And uh, so as I grew up, as I met more people, as I started getting a little older, um, I met my good, my good friend Kyle. And uh, we started, I mean, we just started hunting all the time together. And, uh, and as we got even older, we, we got actually some decent video equipment and we got some, some better hunting property. And that's when we really just started spending countless hours and amounts of money and efforts in the woods and in the field. And just, just trying to capture all of our hunts on, on film because what we'd see on TV just really inspired us. We wanted to, we wanted to eventually someday have something like that. One hunt that, that stands out in my mind, and I think it always will, is I was hunting with my good friend Kyle, and uh, we were in this big timber, uh, a piece that we'd killed several good bucks off of, and uh, we just had a, a beautiful buck come in for probably 45 minutes, just chasing about three other smaller young bucks off, and he was just out of range the whole time. We never even ended up harvesting the deer, but it was just amazing, just absolutely incredible to be able to watch a buck of that caliber for that long just running off other bucks and, and, and chasing this doe around. And it made it even more special to have my friend there with me and even more to have it on video, you know, just to have that whole encounter on video. Because without it, it all it was was a story and something that I would never be able to, to truly portray to my, to my parents or my friends, you know, but having that cameraman with you just makes you be able to share it with the entire world. My passion for hunting doesn't even just stop when you're on, when you're on the actual hunt. It's, it's everything that makes it what it is. It's whether you're shooting your bow all the time, every day, getting ready for the moment for when it actually counts. It's uh, running trail cameras almost all year long and being able to figure out what deer on a certain property. And it's putting in food plots, making, making the property what it needs to be to hold the type of deer and, and to make them what, what they can be. Coming to Northwest, I had a goal in mind that I wanted to be able to, to meet a friend with the same desire and same passion that I had for hunting and videography. And so I got lucky enough to run into uh, our general manager for KNWT, Brett Peters. Um, he sent me over to, uh, and I met with Cody Cooper. And uh, it, was, it was just awesome to be able to meet a friend um, that has the same desire and the same passion that I have um, for filming our hunts, for laying everything we do um, down on film and be able to, to bring it to our audience. And uh, we're, we're both of us, are, we're super excited for the seasons to open up, get some fresh content. And, uh, and to be able to, to pump out some amazing videos um, for you guys to watch here on Bearcat Outdoors. 